Hello everybody, we are back with Mokulala Adventure and yes, today, today guys, we're gonna be talking about the future changes, yes. Alright, so let's not waste any more time, let's get into the Discord. Alright, so again, thanks again to Vola, of course, this is published in 20, on the 11th, uh, 12th of the November, of course, it's already quite late, but anyways, new updates. Very good, why? Because it changes the ancestral tree. The rework, All right? So basically, the blue potions will be removed, guys. Blue potions will be removed from the game. Now, the potions will turn into stones or crystals. Same thing, just a better look. All right, purple will give six percent stats. Legendary, legendary will give twenty percent stats. Even better, fourteen percent increases. All right, so basically, there's now two. Okay, guys, two crystals only. And purple has a limit of 10 per week, but however, legendary has no limit, so now you can technically use more than 10 thing, uh, 10 uh, more than 10 times per week. Right, basically, there are mini crystals, it takes six creamy crystals to make a big crystal. But however, guys, however, you can convert a purple to a legendary. Okay, so for the example, like this one you're seeing on the screen right here, this is the purple. Of course, this is legendary. You cannot convert from a purple to a legendary. So the way you can get legendary, of course, is true to get the other gold shard. But I, uh, but there's no saying. Maybe maybe it's from the shop. Okay, guys, maybe it's from the shop that you can get a gold shard. But however, there's no saying where you can get it yet. But the only thing that you can get. Uh, from maybe from the weekly event is through the purple shards or maybe the uh, uh, the gold shards as you can see here so but right now right right now everything you have everything you have for example the blue portions and the purple portions will be converted to a shard however if you have the gold you would convert to a gold crystal instantly when, when i say gold crystal this is how it looks like this is the gold crystal this is the shards okay guys so what you can what you can do right now is basically tr save up guys save up or use it all all your blue ones or maybe not don't, don't use it because it's it, again it's six percent it's better for you to get the legendary if you can get the legendary if you can get all the two purple portions because it's a one-to-one -one. okay guys it's a one-to-one -one. so i do advise try your best to get a gold one okay but of course it will cost you a lot more however power is power okay guys and uh, yeah okay yep so i'm i was correct uh it is through the uh, the weekly events weekly events you uh get up more you increase your ranks more uh you, uh you get you purchase one of the items and you get the the, uh, the shorts or either the shorts or the crystals all right so farm has been reworked yes oh that is a major change because the current farm is quite boring to be honest yes yes i said it okay it's basically but again it is another power boost you just have to put in your your pet in the in the farm okay let me just uh, show you on the screen here let me get my character or right, let's go to your farm because the current farm looks like this uh okay here we go you have the current farm stop yeah hello yep yep, yep okay skip 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 oh my god skip 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 all right here we go all right so this is the farm right now as you can see basically what we do what we usually do is to click on this and put on put in the best pet eligible all right the best pet we have in our inventory all right so basically everything about, about this will change guys everything about this will change of course i don't have the best setup okay i don't have the best setup but that is not what i'm focusing on all right so the new changes will replace the farm okay guys the farm will be replaced i repeat the farm will be replaced to something like this like this okay so yeah this is how it will look like in the near future so again the what do you call it the the uh the stats is important now as it says here um stats stats boost pet star do actually matter this time yeah the pet star do actually matter this time so basically each of these star does matter to the uh, con um contribute to your 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 pet now, uh, your character now all right so again we don't know how it's gonna work but this is the uh uh what do you call it this is the uh the only picture that we have for this okay and don't worry we'll get to the uh, the new pet soon guys okay <laughs> we'll get to the new pet very very soon all right so another thing 
the totem. There is now a totem to be upgraded using these fossils. And what kind of fossils you might ask? Well, it is a fossils that you can convert through using the shards that you get from the uh, the pads that you don't use at all. It's not the, uh, the fire element or the water or the, uh, the earth. It is the pad itself. Okay, guys. So the stats will might 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 all be pet related, not hundred percent confirmed yet, but we will get it soon. But again, but I don't know when is this gonna be uh, updated. Okay, guys. But uh, in order to get the new fossils in the there's an exchange shop, you can exchange a in the evolution area to abyss been gathering dust in the inventory. You can also get them in lucky ruins, something like this, guys. Something like this. Okay, this is where you can get them. And yes, this is a new one. This is a new lucky ruins a revamp soon coming soon all right okay, guys and with that upgrade you can get the uh all the good stuff and upgrade the total so this is basically, this is basically something like a what do you call that um it's something something that's almost similar to upgrading feeding your pet the more you feed him the more level you get all right so the more i feed him the other food the more power i get something like that is it's almost the same thing as that and once you get to the fifth level you have to get the uh, you do have to uh, upgrade uh, using this item i'm not sure what is this called but it's it is considered as the uh used to break through your totem level right, i don't know how what is this called but is for probably for every five or ten levels which only appear in the lucky ruins shop so it's mostly likely to be in the um the shop area all right and now finally you've been waiting for a new pad guys it is a 10 light yet yeah. is this better than uh than any other pad yes it is better than any other pad and i read through the uh, description already regarding the new pad you can pause the video for right now and uh, check on all the other stats here if, if you want this is all translated roughly translated okay roughly from chinese to english so basically this pad it's mostly a one a single target as far as i understand okay as far as i understand it is not an aoe it is not something like the uh more that the uh, uh bunny uh, tipsy bunny it is mostly in a single target more crit more attack and oh, and one more thing this is what i like about it invincible for three seconds when the owner takes little damage and restore 15 percent of maximum hp so any guys any character can use this pet any character but why because it gave you it, it can sing it if imagine this if you have four guys with this pet it, it is it is a 10 star uh what could it, a 10 stats uh what about uh sun is it sun Oh my god, I don't even know the name anymore. <laughs> uh light, sorry, yeah, light. My bad, my bad, my bad. Okay. <laughs> a light. Ten light pets. So imagine you have four of them. You all of them focusing on one single target, you can nail that character instantly. And if that character has the wrong pad, oof, he's gonna die instantly as well. So again, this is a new top pad in my category. Now, is this way better than any other pet right now? Yes, I would consider that. But of course, the other two are the more, which is Tipsy Bunny Fairy, and of course, the uh, Nunu, Nunubis. Nunubis is also one of the top ones as well, because it's all full darkness. Okay, full dark. So yeah, uh, that's pretty much it for this video. You can, of course, I won't have to talk through this one by one. And you guys can pretty much not understand already. This is uh inflict more damage increases more damage to inflict more damage to a single target provide a stack of bright heart and to, uh to self and the owner every 10 seconds to increase the crit and the more damage yes more damage and more damage and more damage and it cannot be dispelled so that's one of the best thing about this pad oh, wait to get this pad can't wait <laughs> All right, that's pretty much it for this video everybody so uh, let me need, let me know in the comments if you guys have any question got this update uh when is it coming up very soon i don't know but uh, hopefully in the future i can describe more with the, regarding this pet i'll do a top tier list for the uh the new pet soon okay not for this video because i need to adjust a couple, couple of things in here and there regarding the pets which one is better which one is not okay guys but so far on this video thanks guys for watching i'll see you guys on the next one all right stay safe 
and again thanks to Volak for the uh, information all right my man Volak my man all right that's it for me Diva uh that's it for me for today thank you so much thank you guys for watching see you guys next one be safe peace and cheer everybody <laughs>